Hello, welcome to episode 11 of SOS Stockport County. Now, it's such a lovely day, I thought I'd step out of the office, just over there, in the Danny Bagheera stand, and come outside and film this special episode that's live on TV, here, live, at Edgeley Park. So, before we get into anything, let's just watch the highlights. Go oh, good tackle by Roberts, he wins the ball, gets it to Dennis. Dennis didn't know what to do with it, but he's found Conley on the right-hand side. Now everybody knows what Conley can do. He can whip a cracking ball in. He's found Dennis. Come on, lads. 1-0 in the dying minutes of this match. Come on, County. Just kicked off. Can we attack him straight away? High pings it out to Thomas on the right-hand side. Thomas, low cross, straight to Dennis. 12 seconds gone. And Dennis brought him back in the team, and he's starting to score again. What a legend. Penalty now, can Nelson add a score and equaliser, he does, right hand side, Dean Anderson dies the right way, just can't get it, it's 1-1. Brown has the ball now, come on lads, get forward with it, get forward, Roberts has the ball, he's looking up, he's past the queue in the middle of the pack, Q's long ball shot to Thomas, lays it off to Hyde, Hyde with a cracking shot, blasts it in the top left corner, it's 1-0 to County. Santos now, pings it forward, he finds Dennis on the left hand side of the goal, Dennis has kept that in, I thought that went out, he's got it in, the, he's got a ball into Thompson, and that's 2-0, bit scrappy, didn't expect it, but who cares, come on County. Free kick now, aims from his centre half, taking it, and he scored it, <laughs> I thought the keeper was going to get an answer to that, he's gone straight through his hand, but who cares, 1-0. Come on lads, we now passes it back to Roberts, he's charging forward, he's found Connor Brown on the right hand side, Connor Brown crosses it in, Dennis, oh Dennis, gets his left foot to it, a famous left foot, scores another goal, his third goal of the season and we're beating Torquay 2-0. Laid it off to Berry. Berry's blasted it forward trying to find Simpson, Simpson brought it down lovely and he's laid it off to Alan, Alan shoots and what was Dean Henderson doing, cracking keeper but wow, 2-1, Torquay pull one back, That's Roberts. Tries to find Jake Hyde. Jake Hyde is a cracking target, man. He wins the ball, lays it off to Thompson. Thompson gives it to Roberts. Come on, Rob. Oh, he's found Connor Brown on the right-hand side. What could Connor Brown do? Oh, he's found Hall, who's lofted it back into Thompson. The hell and Chamberlain, are you watching this? 3-1, have that. Come on. I'll come back from the highlights. Um, we've, we've started it in form. I've gone for my poacher, two up top tactic, and it's working. Christian Dennis has been playing. He's been scoring goals, so... I'm really happy with the way we're going, um, we're climbing up the table, and yeah, I couldn't be happier. I've had a nice morning in the office in the Danny Bagheera stand. Um, Danny Bagheera is a club legend. You'd probably see him in every intro of my video. Um, he's from Uruguay, and the club still uh, flies a Uruguay flag in his honour. So we looked at him last um, episode a little bit. Well, we had an interview with him. So I thought we'd just have a quick look at Jakey. Um, he's been playing pretty well. He's scored six goals in 15 games. His average rating is just over seven. But, you know, he's a decent player. And, um, well, you know, I've, 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 I've brought in some more players too because I started the season with just three strikers. So I thought it would be best if we got more strikers because um, I think I want to stick with two up top for now, especially because we keep winning. Now, before we discuss any of my new signings, I just wanted to highlight Joe Thompson again and let you have a closer look at him because I didn't highlight him at the start of the season. But he's been brilliant for me. His average rating is 7.29. Um, he scores goals, he assists. He's a great player. So, yeah, Joe Thompson, hopefully, you know, he's going to help us, well, he's going to help lead this club to a championship. Okay, as you can see in my in list, I've made about five signings. Now, only one of them's an half decent signing. He's just a backup striker. I'll show you him in a minute. The other lads I've picked up on freebies, all kids, all about 17 years old. Um, just looking towards the future, trying to build my youth team up. So, let's have a look at Jordan Brown. Yeah, so obviously, my main two is going to be Jake Hyde and Christian Dennis. But, with Darlington, obviously, that kid who uh, scored in the last live comp in the last episode, but I brought in Jordan here because, you know, he was free. He can finish, I mean, his, his, his technicals aren't the greatest, but he's rapid, absolutely rapid for this level, and he's got a lot of potential ability. So, I think he's going to be a great backup striker. Okay, quick look at player form. As you can see, Q's played a few games, he's top of the list. 
but he really hadn't, he hadn't played as many as other people. And then there's the main man, Joe Thompson. He's, a, he's slowly becoming a club legend, definitely becoming one of my favourite players. Followed by Daniel Roberts, Ologu, cracking signing for me. Andy Tanoy, he's not really played. Um, he just can't get in the team. Got Ologu and Roberts, who are just better than him. Um, then we've got Good, uh, Goodman, defender, Connor Brown, Monte, Hyde and Ameson. Yeah, you know, we're starting to really play really well. Well, we've been playing well all year. Um, but we start to win games, which is the most important thing. I mean, we're second in the table. Let's have a look. So, as you can see, our recent farm has rocketed us up to second place. And we're only a point behind Bristol Rovers, which is amazing. Because, obviously, I started I started this season really hopeful. Really, I was buzzing by the players we signed. Um, but, obviously, we weren't winning games. So, now we're winning. Uh, I'm, I'm super excited. And, and, I'm, and I believe we might do back-to-back -back promotions. I mean, that's the ultimate dream, really, isn't it? So... Let's have a look at today's opponents in our live com. Okay, here they are, Maidenhead. The 12th in the league, we're about, about mid-table. Uh, they haven't won for three games. So I'm expecting a victory, especially the farm we're in and the farm they're in. And I think we've got more quality. Um, we're at home, it's on TV. We're here, we're here at the home of Edgeley Park, which, by the way, I don't know if you can see. But we've got a new security guard down there. I um, don't think you'll be able to see him from here. He looks like Slash. He's got a hat like Slash and long hair tragic as you can see we're playing our two up top formation um it's been winning games so i'm happy with it so we've got dean henderson in net we've got o'leary at left back santos is going to play today because he's been playing pretty well we've got ameson partnering him in the center of defense connor brown we right back cuanza is going to play instead of monte because uh, monte ain't fully fit um roberts in the middle thompson on the right hall on the left and we've got the front partnership of Dennis and Hyde, which is perfect, really, because Hyde's a perfect target man, and Dennis is a perfect poacher. Let's get into the game. Before we start today's live com, just need to explain what you're about to see. Now, when I filmed this episode live at Edgeley Park and got home to edit it, um, for some reason, the entire live com has just gone insane. It's, it's very, very strange. My mouth looks like this guy did in a police academy. <laughs> So, I've had to relay new footage over my original audio, mix it up a bit and try and make the best live com I can. So, I'm sure it hasn't spoiled your viewing pleasure and hopefully you'll still enjoy this live com. Stockport County versus Maidenhead. So here we are, we kick off here at the beautiful Edgeley Park. Let's see if we can pick up three points today. So yeah, I just thought it'd be a nice little touch. Step out of the office, show you the famous Danny Bigera stand. It's a lovely day. Um, got my charges hat on. I'm in a good mood. So let's get three points today, eh? David O'Leary now. Throws it to Dennis. Dennis crosses in the box. He finds Hyde. Hyde shots deflected. Corner ball now for Stockport. Thompson now on the ball. Floats it in. Oh, he's found Dennis on the edge of the box. Can Dennis do anything? Give it back to Thompson. Let Thompson cross it in. Come on, Dennis. He does give it back to Thompson, but gives the ball away. Okay, I'm going to make a sub um, because Kuan's has picked up a knock. Let's make a change. Oh, no. Made end of the ball now. Oh, the shot's deflected. Come on, lads. Come on. Get the ball away. Can we get the ball away? 27 minutes gone, and we've had one shot. They've had three. This is probably the most boringest game on TV ever. Montu's back, oh, Montu's on the pitch. He's found Dennis. Dennis has a shot and the keeper gathers that easily. Roberts now pings the ball out wide to Hall. Hall on the left hand side gives it to O'Leary. O'Leary with the first time cross. Oh, Dennis has a shot and then he has another shot but nothing come of it. Corner ball now. Come on lads. Can Thompson find someone? Cross it in, mate. Cross it in. Cross it into the danger zone and Maidenhead get it away. But Thompson's going to gather the ball. He pings it back to O'Leary. Can O'Leary float it in? Come on, mate. Float it in. He's trying to find Hyde. Hyde is a big lad, but didn't get the ball. But oh, there you go. Roberts has. Roberts won it back for Stockport. What's he going to do? Nothing. On the ball now. Come on, Thompson. Come on, lad. Gives it out to Dennis on the edge of the box. Can Dennis have a crack with his left foot? He does, and the keeper pulls off a cracking save. Thompson now with a corner. Flows it out to Dennis again on the edge of the box. We love to do this, don't we? That's a great shot. Oh, and it goes just over. Come on, boys. We've not done a lot here today. We've had six shots, three on target. Two clear cut. 
Uh, but it's been quite a tight game. I mean, we've dominated the possession, but we've not really created many chances. Not any really great chances. Not in, not in my view, anyway. But Thompson's on the ball now. Can he do anything? He's found Monty now in the middle. Monty's trying to find Dennis. Can Dennis get a shot off? Gets blocked. David O'Leary with a throw in now on the left hand side. Long throw on him. Finds Roberts. Roberts finds Hall. What can Hall do now? Hall pings it forward, trying to find um, Christian Dennis, but he's never going to get that. But Jake Hyde's got onto it. Jake Hyde, left foot strike. Brilliant. Pounced on it. 1 0. Let's watch the replay. Yeah, the ball's kind of hit and hoped down the left hand side. Dennis had no chance. I think the defender here, what was he doing? Laid it on a plate for Jake Hyde. Bangs it in, 1 0. Maiden had find an equaliser just before the end of the first half. Come on, lads, let's defend. Let's go in to the half time, into the locker room over there with a lead. Come on, get onto him, get onto him. Oh, great save. Santos blocks it. Henderson saves it. It's a corner ball, and we're in the dying seconds of the first half here. Get it away, boys, get it away. Yes, yeah, so first half started off pretty boring. It's got a bit better. Jake scored a cracking goal, massive mistake from their defender. So we're going in 1 0. I'm just going to tell them that things are going well, and we're, but we're capable of better. Let's win this match. Corner ball, Thompson, right hand side. Floats it to the edge of the box to Dennis again. Dennis gets a shot off, he does, but it goes wide. Brown with the throw in on the right hand side. Finds Jake Hyde. Jake Hyde gives it back to Brown. Can Brown ping it into the box? He doesn't, but he finds Monty in the middle of the park. Monty lays it all the way out left to O'Leary. Beautiful cross. But Maiden had have defended it, but Hall's recovered it. Pass it back to O'Leary, who's looking like he can cross a ball in. It's in the box, it's in the net. What a goal. Cracking goal. Jake Hyde again. Let's watch the replay. Yeah, this is only his fourth league goal of the season. O'Leary now pings a ball in the box. Jake Hyde just bangs it in the net. Brilliant. 2 0. Come on, County. Come on, lads. Let's hold on to this league. Half an hour left. 50 50 possession, I'd say, but we are dominating in chances. Dennis on the ball balloons it over the bar. Thompson now of a corner, floats it in, oh it's defended but it's recovered by Dennis on the edge of the box, can he put in a danger ball, he does but it's just over. Ok making a substitution or made it, um, Jake Hines absolutely knackered, looks like he's going to have an heart attack, so I've brought on Gareth Darlington in his place, fresh legs up front, young lad, maybe he can nick us a third goal. Corner ball now, Thompson on the right hand side, just spraying out to Dennis again, Dennis on the edge of the box, he has a shot and that looks just over again. Maiden ending the attack now. Can they get a goal back or can we keep a clean sheet? I want to keep a clean sheet. Everyone wants to keep a bloody clean sheet, don't they? Right. Darlington now. Fresh legs up front. Gives it to Dennis. Dennis now, what can he do? Come on, Dennis, lad. Gives it to Monty. Monty, back to Roberts. Roberts pings it out wide to Brown. Brown, get the ball in. Crosses it in. He does. He finds Hall, who's shot. He's saved. Just over 10 minutes left here at Edgeley Park. We're going to get three points. That means a chance. We could go top of the league at the end of today, and that would be amazing. Hall finds Dennis. What can Dennis do? Dennis has found Darlington. Darlington. Come on, lad. Always oh, tackle from behind by Massey. That might be a booking. Might be a red card. I think he's already on a booking. It's going to give him his second yellow. Uh, Massey's off. Maiden and down. A 10 men. Five minutes to go. I think this game is in the bag for us. Thompson with a shot. Free kick to Brown on the right hand side. Brown laid up to Darlington. Darlington gets a shot off, but the keeper pulls off a great save. I tell you, today has been an absolutely top class match for TV. And that's it. Full time whistle. 2 0 on TV. Two great goals from Jake Hyde. Uh, couldn't be happier. Brilliant result for us. Let's have a look at the league table. Okay, so after that game um, and after 11 matches in the league, we still sit in second place. A point behind Bristol Rovers and a point in front of Newport. But we're in the right direction. We're going in the right direction. We're playing really good football, winning football games. So I couldn't be happier, to be fair. Really, really couldn't be happier. So let's have a look who we're going to play in episode 12. So, I'm going to play the next three games off camera and we're going to come back against what is at the minute our title rival, Bristol Rovers, who are sitting just a, a point above us in the league at, in the top spot. So, you know, play three games off camera, come back, play these, should be a cracking game for a live com and hopefully we'll beat them and hopefully get to the top of the league. Okay, that is the end of episode 11. Um, thought it'd be a bit different. 
bit of a live episode here at Edgeley Park. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your continued support. I hope you did enjoy the episode. And I hope you come back for episode 12. So, have a nice day. Take care. And I'll see you later.